Hi, just a quick video on my new UPS battery. I used to have this kind of battery in my UPS before, and this is a sealed lead acid battery, it's a rechargeable battery, and it's also a maintenance battery. I don't have to pour some uh, battery acid or battery fluid. It has 12 volt 8 ampere hour capacity and you can see the specs but the issue with this kind of battery is they don't last much longer uh, in my experience one to two years that's the maximum two years is all the maximum lifetime now I'm replacing with this battery it's a lithium iron phosphate battery and it's right now the latest technology the only downside is it has lower capacity but if you know about batteries then you also know that lithium ion batteries have much larger depth of discharge compared to the lead acid ones so 6.6 uh, ampere is not is not a big deal so i have also already dissected this battery to show you all how it's in the inside so there are four cells these are 32 250 cells I guess or 32 700 and it has a BMS and all these batteries are in series because these batteries are 6 ampere ones with volt uh, 3.2 volt and you can see th that this BMS is a very simple BMS it has uh, 20 ampere capacity and it's a 4 series B uh, BMS that is 4S and there's nothing much in the inside there's some glues adhesives to keep it in position and some foam so the great advantage of this battery is it has much larger lifetime than this one and another another advantage to me is if suppose one of these cells get damaged then I can have them replaced and have them welded and it's pretty simple there is no fluid involved there is no gas or something like that it's quite safe because of the BMS so there is no risk of having over discharge or overcharge so this is another big advantage and if I wish to replace these batteries for some reason if I wish to let's say the technology gets improved in the future and the capacity goes beyond 6 ampere per cell so I can have them replaced and replaced with the new ones for that I will be needing welding machines like this these are portable welding machines and also this one this is another portable lithium uh, lithium ion battery welding machine that I can use to build cells as per my requirement I have the cells arranged in my require as per my requirement and I can have them arranged in a way that can meet my specs and my requirements. So it's pretty simple, there is nothing much. If I measure the voltage of this battery at this moment, you will see it's fully charged. I just unboxed it a few hours back, so it's fully charged. Unlike the old school lead acid batteries, which typically have a full charge voltage of 12.6 volt, this one had 13 volt, almost 13 volt full charge voltage. So I guess this will be a very good addition to my UPS and I hope that it keeps its promise of having a lifetime of three years that will be all thanks for watching